Part 1. Listen to the full conversation. Hey, have you ever thought about investing our savings? Yeah, I'm considering it, but I'm not sure where to start. Well, you could look into stocks or bonds. They're common options. Stocks? Sounds a bit risky. What about something safer? True, stocks can be volatile. How about a savings account? It's low risk. But the returns are so low. Isn't there a middle ground? Have you thought about mutual funds? They offer a balance between risk and return. Mutual funds? How do they work? Basically, they pool money from multiple investors to invest in a diversified portfolio. Diversified portfolio? That sounds complicated. It just means spreading your investments across different assets to reduce risk. Got it. What about real estate? That's a thing, right? Absolutely. Real estate can be a good long-term investment. Property values tend to appreciate. But it requires a lot of money up front, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Maybe we could start with a real estate investment trust, REI, instead. REIT? Never heard of it. It's like investing in real estate, but you buy shares in a company that owns and manages properties. That sounds more manageable. How about cryptocurrency? Cryptocurrency is volatile. It's like a roller coaster. You can gain big, but you can also lose big. Risky, huh? Maybe I'll pass on that one. What about gold? Gold is a traditional safe haven asset. It tends to hold its value during economic uncertainties. Sounds solid. How do we invest in gold? You can buy physical gold, like coins or bars, or invest in gold exchange-traded funds, ETFs. ETFs? Are they complicated? Not really. ETFs are like baskets of different assets, and you can buy shares just like stocks. Interesting. What's your take on a 401k? It's a retirement savings plan, usually sponsored by employers. They often match your contributions. Free money? I'm in. How about bonds? I've heard they're stable. Bonds are loans you give to companies or governments. They're less risky than stocks. But do they pay well? Not as much as stocks, but they provide a steady income stream through interest payments. I see. So, what's your recommendation for us? I'd suggest a diversified approach. Maybe a mix of stocks, bonds and a savings account for emergencies. Sounds like a plan. Let's do it. Practice session. Let's practice together. I'll go first. Hey, have you ever thought about investing our savings? Well, you could look into stocks or bonds. They're common options. True, stocks can be volatile. How about a savings account? It's low risk. Have you thought about mutual funds? They offer a balance between risk and return. Basically, they pool money from multiple investors to invest in a diversified portfolio. It just means spreading your investments across different assets to reduce risk. Absolutely. Real estate can be a good long-term investment. Property values tend to appreciate. Yes, it does. Maybe we could start with a real estate investment trust, REI, instead. It's like investing in real estate, but you buy shares in a company that owns and manages properties. Cryptocurrency is volatile. It's like a roller coaster. You can gain big, but you can also lose big.
Gold is a traditional safe haven asset. It tends to hold its value during economic uncertainties. You can buy physical gold, like coins or bars, or invest in gold exchange traded funds, ETFs. Not really. ETFs are like baskets of different assets and you can buy shares just like stocks. It's a retirement savings plan, usually sponsored by employers. They often match your contributions. Bonds are loans you give to companies or governments. They're less risky than stocks. Not as much as stocks, but they provide a steady income stream through interest payments. I'd suggest a diversified approach. Maybe a mix of stocks, bonds and a savings account for emergencies. Now, let's switch the role. You go first. Yeah, I'm considering it, but I'm not sure where to start. Stocks? Sounds a bit risky. What about something safer? But the returns are so low. Isn't there a middle ground? Mutual funds? How do they work? Diversified portfolio? That sounds complicated. Got it. What about real estate? That's a thing, right? But it requires a lot of money up front, doesn't it? REIT? Never heard of it. That sounds more manageable. How about cryptocurrency? Risky, huh? Maybe I'll pass on that one. What about gold? Sounds solid. How do we invest in gold? ETFs? Are they complicated? Interesting. What's your take on a 401k? Free money? I'm in. How about bonds? I've heard they're stable. But do they pay well? I see. So, what's your recommendation for us? Sounds like a plan. Let's do it.